So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to actually change your mouse cursor on Windows 11. Also, if you do find this video helpful and for more content like this in the future, make sure you drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel with all post notifications turned on, and leave a comment down below with any questions that you might have so I can help you. But with all that being said, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. So the Windows 11 update is fairly new, so I thought I'd do a video showing you how to actually change your mouse cursor on Windows 11, as it has actually changed quite a lot. So we're not gonna waste any time, let's go ahead and get straight into it. So the first thing that you are gonna wanna go ahead and do is simply click on the search bar here and just type in the word mouse, and you are gonna see a section called mouse settings. So simply click on that. Next, it is a lot different from Windows 10. You are gonna see this screen right here, and there are a few different directions that you can take from this point here. But in this video, I will be showing you all of them just so you guys know what options you have. So firstly, we're going to go down to the bottom where it does say mouse pointer options. So we can click on this here. And as a default, we are given four mouse options. Don't worry, these aren't the only ones. These are just the main ones that Windows actually give you. So you've got the main default one here, which is just the white one that I've got on now. Next, we've got the exact same thing, but in black, and it does have a slight shadow on it. So that does look quite cool. Next, we've got another black one, but it is actually transparent. As you can see when it goes through things, it is actually a PNG image. And next we've got a default one but you can customize your own color on it and if the color that you want isn't on here you can just simply click on choose another color and then you can pick any color that actually exists also as an additional setting you can actually increase the size of this from here simply by dragging and dropping and as you can see it does go pretty big but for me i'm just going to use the smallest one now if you don't like the options given to you there just simply do the exact same thing again just type in mouse but this time go to additional mouse settings not mouse pointer and then from here it is going to open this little tab up here where all you do is go straight over to the pointers tab and you can see because i picked a red one it is going to show them to me in red but obviously if i go back to the default one it is just going to show me the normal ones so what you do from here is you simply go over to normal select and click on the browse and from here you'll see all of the mouse cursors that are available for you to use now obviously if you've got your own custom version you can obviously import it but i'm not going to be showing you how to do that in this video as that is quite complicated but let's say for instance i want this air remove one i'm just going to simply click on it and then click open and you can see it won't work straight away and you have to click apply and then you can click OK. And now you have a new mouse cursor in Windows 11. As I said at the start, if you did find this video helpful, make sure to drop a like on it and subscribe to the channel as that really does help me out a lot. We are trying to push for 15,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So any help towards that is massively appreciated. But a massive thank you to all for watching the video and I hope to see you all in the next one.